All right. Hey guys, it is Dr. Eric here with Dr. Prodigy, and I have just placed the keystones in. We just finished battling Pippet, and now I'm going to push the button and we're going to see what happens next. Oh, the Puppet Master! Yes, of course. I thought you were going to let me use the keystones. Are you kidding? Oh, Puppet Master battle! Oh no, he's got a shadowy surprise for us. I've never been here before. Where are we going? 2,500. All right, we're moving on to more third grade questions. These are not related to shapes. These are a collection of third grade. Let's take a look. Jaden has a collection of comic books to share. They give Mateus 12 comic books. They give Yuna five times as many comic books as Mateus write a multiplication sentence. Well, Mateus has 12. Yuna gets five times as much. So 12 times five. Okay. Five times two is 10. Carry the one. Five times one is five. And then we have to add this extra one. So that's what we've got. 12, five, and 60. All right, excuse me, 12, five, and here's our 60. Let's see if we can do this. I mean, that is one epic monster that we are battling right now. Shadow Gerald. Oh my gosh, all right, Starbit. Let's see if we can do anything with Starbit. And it's weak against snow. I don't, I didn't even remember to change my pets. Oh my gosh, this is gonna be tough. All right, let's look at another third grade question. Carrie has, or Karari maybe, has a stamp collection to share. Sumitra has 20 stamps, and Delia has three times as many stamps as Sumitra. All right, so Sumitra gets 20 stamps from Kari. Delia has three times as many as Sumitra. Now, I'm just saying that some of those things aren't very, very fair, you know. Like, why is one friend getting three times as many, is what I want to know. But, it's just a math problem. Three times zero is zero. Three times two is six. So we have 60. You probably could have done it in your head. Two times three and then add the ten. All right. We're going to try this. Come on. Magic has been refilled. I wonder if it's always going to be snow and we should have a snow pet also. Tyrone has a bookmark collection. They give Aisha 50 bookmarks. And they give Michaela five times as many bookmarks. Here's my other question. Why does Tyrone have 250 bookmarks to give away? Like, who has that many? How do I know it was 250? Well, I just said, okay, I know I'm going to, 50 is 5 times 10. So if I can do 5 times 5 to get me 25 and then bring down the 10. I would like to know why Tyrone has 250 bookmarks to give away. Like, that's crazy. Um, what spell are we getting? I guess we'll use this one. Down portal. You got to Come on, big money, big money, big money. Gerald, oh my gosh, I don't know if we're going to really actually win you? this battle. No, it's not. It's yes! I had some help. Thank you for the help. Let's see what happens. Star bit. Ice cubicle. Takes one to recharge, but let's just use it. Powerful. Okay, okay. We might, we might, is that with the help of those fairies, we might be okay. We might be okay. All right, looks like we have another word problem to do. Kareem has a collection of toy cars to share. They give Fathia 10 toy cars and they give Marley two times as many. So you guys are already probably saying like Dr. Erig, one times two is two. Bring down the zero because we know we're multiplying by tens. If we were multiplying by hundreds, we would put down two zeros at the end. So simply dimply, let's see what happens. A drench. Miss, we got it right. Okay, it's getting close. We might have a chance to win. We might have a chance. On 
has a box of crayons to share. They give Hina 40 crayons and they give Claude two times as many. So again, you can either do it like this where you have zero and then eight for 80 or because 40 has a zero at the end, we just bring that zero down and do four times eight either way. Skill complete. We got multiplication done. Excellent. Great job. Air high five. We have even a rank one. All right. We'll take our rank one for multiplication. Let's see if there's anything to do to help us with this battle, though. 368. Not too bad. Not too bad. Enemy stern. What? Unreal. I was not expecting that. All right, now we're talking about prime numbers versus composite. Composite numbers are anything, let's see what they tell you, that can be divided, divided by one itself and at least one other number. So for example, if I list these numbers right here, let's move my head out of the way. We know it's not gonna be one. Two can only be one times two. There's no other number that we could do that. Three can be one times three. Four can be one times four, which is one in itself, but two times two is also four. A composite number so that means that four one. would be it's considered a composite. a composite. Five, we can only do one times five. So that means that two, three, and five are all prime numbers. Four is composite. So when we look at 14, 14 we can do 1 times 14 but we could also do 2 times 7 so because there's another set of factors that makes 14 composite and we won't go as slowly on the next question we're just that was our first time seeing prime and composite come on come on shadow gerald all right 29 prime and composite so when we look at 29 we know that one times 29 works. 29 is an odd number, so two can't go into it. If we think about, we know five can't go into it because of it doesn't end in five or zero. So we can say, can three go into it? But we know that three times nine is 27 and three times 10 is 30, so that won't work. Six is even, so that won't work. Seven, we could try seven. Well, we know that 7 times 4 is 28, and 7 times 5 is 35, so no. We've tried a bunch of examples. 29 is definitely a prime number. And that's how you can do it. If you don't have your prime numbers memorized, just test it out. Keep testing it out. No big deal. Down portal. Come on, you're out of here. Get out. Get out. He didn't get out. All right. Miss! You had a miss! Hit miss. We might be actually be able to win. Is 43 prime or composite? Well, it's not an even number, so we know that 2 cannot go into 43. We could try 3. Okay, 3 goes into 4 one time. But 3 can't go into 13 evenly. We would have a remainder. We would have a remainder 1, so it won't be 3. Four is even, five, it doesn't end in five or zero. Six, we could try seven. We know that seven times six is 42, so there's no way seven can go in evenly. 43 is definitely a prime number because the only factors are one in itself. I think I picked up one. Portal, come on, get out of here. We're done with you. 54 left, come on. This enemy's turn, watch. Oh, phew. 37, 37 is another example of a prime number. We're just gonna move on because I wanna get this battle over. All right. Thump seems to be my best spell I got. Yes. All right. 333 battle stars, did you see that? 
And we up to level 75. Whoa. Whoa, 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 whoa. Awesome with our rewards going. I'm gonna hit continue. We're not gonna evolve our pet. We're not gonna worry about member stars. All right, let's see what happens. Actually, I'm gonna pause it right here. Let's see what questions we get next. Bye guys.